Debbie? Hey. We have a wonderful opportunity today. You probably more than I. We have some wonderful maple products that you probably have never even heard of. I'm sure you're aware of the maple syrup. Right. But there's mustards, there's drizzles, there's popcorn, there's sodas, there's cookies, wow. there's chocolate. There's just a lot of stuff that I think people are not aware of and it is all fantastic. Wow, well I'm excited to try it. So Debbie, give me a little bit of your history uh, in terms of where you're from and have you experienced any of these prior to, to this little um, tasting we had today? Well, Clyde, I am from Arkansas. So we would have never known. I know, with my southern accent, love it. But it's important to me to try other cultures, even within the states. We'll start with the traditional maple syrup. You've probably had that on pancakes yes. or, or um, French toast or whatever. You can actually uh, incorporate it in baked beans. You can pour it over oh. ice cream. This is, a, this is a phenomenal product. It has so many different uses. Um, I'm ruined. I can't do the store product ever again. Uh, my family and I call it liquid gold. This maple mustard is kind of a unique little deal. We kind of put some on some pretzels. Okay. And we're just going to dip it in that mustard a little bit. It's right here. Let me get that for you. Okay. Oh, it's thick. I think you're going to find that it's quite thick. Sweet, yet wow. it has a nice little That has a kick to it, punch to it. Kick to it. That is nice, it's really Clyde. good, isn't it? Let's I'm surprised. It is surprising. Mm -hmm. Strong. Just as surprising, but on the other end of the spectrum, maple drizzle. We're going from spicy, we're going to go to sweet again. We're going to okay. take one of these little vanilla wafers. Help yourself. Okay. We're going to put a little bit on there for you. Whoops. That's all right. And I'm going to try a little. Oh my. This is described, I believe, as uh, homemade apple pie in a jar. As we go further on, we get into the hors d'oeuvre arena with respect to um, to the maple products. Okay. There's pepperonis, there's cheeses, um, there's sausages. Help yourself. Grab a little. Thank you. Take a piece of cheese. Take a piece of pepperoni. Okay. We we'll try the cheese first. All of these are either made with maple, or uh -huh. in the case of the sausage, it's uh, smoked. Great flavor. Good? I mean, we could stand here all day. I, I could, know. I could stand here all I day. I will. For sure. Love it. Let's cleanse our palates a little bit. Okay. Vermont maple soda. Sparkling soda. Mm. Already poured some for you. Give it a little try. Cheers. To Vermont. Wow. And of course, we can't forget this product. <laughs> no, those. I actually brought some home to, these, to my wife, Lucy, and uh, when she was done, she uh, said, don't bring them home anymore. Oh. Because they're addicting, and she could just eat them forever, and so could I. But they are wonderful. Wow. Give it a taste. It mm. is so sweet, so wonderful, so like a maple mouth. leaf. Yeah, wow. Mmm. Huh? Uh, Excellent. You could make. I could make a meal out of those. I could too. <laughs> I'm sure people would, would not like to see <laughs> me do it, but you know that could happen. There. This is the essence of Vermont maple products, and we have all of these available at the country store here at Smuggler's Notch. Uh, we're going to be having some tastings coming up this okay. next, uh, this coming weekend and the following two weeks. Okay. And we can't wait for folks to come over and give them a try. Cheers again. Cheers. Mm -hmm.